Good morning, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the Command 66 Day Challenge 3.0. Today is day 16, and yesterday we wrapped up our series on the Contacts submenu or applet. And as I mentioned in video number one, we're going to work through each one of the submenus and applets kind of with a series of videos on each one of those. And yet between each one of those series, we do have a couple of uh, wildcard videos planned for updates that have happened to command during that time. So today is one of those wildcard days, and we're going to talk about uh, the ability now to un or bulk unsubscribe people to a smart plan. So we're going to look at that by basically diving into smart plans. It's our fourth applet here down on the left hand side. When you get into smart plans, you're going to be able to see my smart plans and then the library of available smart plans to choose from. If you're brand new or pretty new to command and you haven't really played with smart plans, don't worry. We do have a video series planned for smart plans. And yet these are the plans that I have moved over into my personal library, if you will, from the KWRI available library. So these nine smart plans are all available for me to add. And yet I've only added, I think it's six so far that I have in here that I've been playing with, five of them. So the cool new update, you can see this new icon, this eyeball icon next to the monthly neighborhood nurture smart plan is now an ability. You can see that I can click on it when I hover over it. When I click on that eye, it's going to now show me the 33 contacts that have been subscribed to this neighborhood nurture smart plan. You can see it shows 20 at a time. And I now have the ability to select multiple contacts and unsubscribe them at once. So I could also do all 20, or excuse me, click on all 20 by just selecting all. It's gonna select all 20 contacts in a row. And then I can unsubscribe all 20 if I wanted to from this smart plan with just a couple of keystrokes. In the past, we used to have to dive into each individual contact record and remove them from that smart plan. So a very easy, simple, straightforward way if you have multiple contacts on a smart plan that you want to unsubscribe from that smart plan, you now have that ability again by diving into smart plans, making sure you're under your smart plans, and then clicking on the eyeball icon that is available next to your contacts for smart plans that you have more than one person subscribed to. Quick and easy unsubscribe, and I can now do it in bulk by just clicking on those multiple contacts, clicking on confirm unsubscribe. It'll say this is the smart plan you want to unsubscribe the following contacts from. And here are those contacts. If I wanted to do it, I would just click on confirm. And all of a sudden I am now, request to unsubscribe contacts has been submitted. Uh, so I assume that that will happen shortly. Those um, contacts will no longer be on those smart plans and I can move them into something. Maybe I want to move them into a bi-weekly instead of monthly neighborhood smart plan or you know, a long-term or mid-term follow-up smart plan as well. So again, if you're new to Keller Williams or new to KW Command and you're not sure 100% what I'm talking about with regards to smart plans, hold tight. We've got that video series coming for you soon. Uh, and yet those of you that are familiar, you'll now understand the ability and the awesomeness because uh, diving into each contact record individually does take a lot more time. So that's it for today, guys. Hope everyone's having a fantastic Saturday. And as always, I will look forward to speaking with you in the morning. Thanks so much.